This one's kind of weird. Okay, another Apple Store story. Look at this transition. A man was robbed after buying 300 iPhones from the Apple. I didn't even think you're allowed to buy 300 iPhones. Yeah, it's very questionable. An unnamed 27-year-old man purchased 300 iPhones from Apple Fifth Avenue. Man, you're going to have a hell of a title on this clip, Will. Mm. Man buys 300 iPhones. You'll never guess what happens next. Exactly. Man robbed shortly after purchasing 300. How does one man buy 300? Uh, and he went to the Fifth Avenue Apple Store, very high-profile location. Yep, That's yep. the glass cube coming up out of the ground with the staircase down. He was carrying 300 iPhone 13s. 13s. Yeah, to so sell in his uh, own store. In three bags and walking to his car at 1.45 a.m. Is that Apple store still open 24 hours? I guess. He's walking at 1.45 a.m. That's pretty cool on its own, the idea of a 24-hour Apple yeah. store. Uh, another car pulled up next to him. Two men jumped out and demanded that he hand over the bags, not wanting to hand over three hundred iPhones, the victim put up a fight and was ultimately punched in the face before thieves made off with one of the bags. The bag contained 125 iPhones valued at $95,000. So he was walking around 200 grand worth of iPhones. At Do least. you at any point think there's a red flag? Like a story is like fake. So or like an insurance fraud? planned, yeah. Insurance fraud, you guys come up and rob me. I mean, I feel me bad for the guy if it actually happened, but. Listen, I. Why would you buy 300 iPhones at 145 a.m.? Well, well, that's all I'm saying. Easy, Will. I see your skeptical, the skeptical look on your face. I see the skeptical look in your cheeks. Yeah, I'm just a <laughs> balloon. <laughs> skeptical balloon over there. I don't know. It is kind of a crazy story. Maybe uh, there's a lot of maybes. I can't state one way or the other. There's a maybe over here. There's a maybe over there. Um. Apple's Fifth Avenue location is open 24 hours a day, allowing for early morning purchase. Apple also had a Black Friday sale going on at the time, which the thieves may have been aware of. This is the thing. You think that they get the tip. What is the inside nature of it? Could an employee at the Apple store be like, hey, man, a guy just walked out of here. He's got 300 iPhones. Uh, you better post up over there and be ready to go. Uh, yeah, okay. I'm not making that accusation. I'm just, I'm just say, stating the possibilities. We're having a thought experiment uh -huh. here. I mean, yeah, of course yeah, yeah. that didn't happen and, and, and i wouldn't know if it did also somebody could have followed him from before somebody could know him from his store or it could be um completely bogus as you suggested where you're going to claim the insurance or something on it uh -huh. but but you had wait a second he still had to purchase them he still had to pay up front yeah. how does that work that doesn't seem like if he's in on the scam um, this is all uh a bit much for me to process at the moment it, it could it's probably not an insurance thing yeah. Um, oh, Mo, Mo is over there, and Mo wants to come say something. Mo, come on over. What? What was it you stated there? Yeah, come on over. We, I can't hear you from <laughs> over there. Mumbling. Yeah, he's just he's mumbling to himself, and he assumes we can hear what his input is. But he has been motivated. There's a seat right there. Mic's not live. Yeah, we can turn the mic on. Oh, no. no, we can't. Okay, you can use mine. Uh, I said maybe he can claim losses because maybe this is a business opportunity for him and now it's stolen so he's loss of business opportunity mm -hmm. he, right so you're saying the expenses plus whatever profits he's gonna make yeah could be could be just saying where are you, no, where are you going though <laughs> he's running away i don't know it's uh we're all speculating someone else is going to speculate in the comments point being 300 iphones in two bags going down the street at 1 45 a.m and don't uh, you think like security would help him out we we have a lot of shoulda would escort him or something who knows what's going on we have tons of that going on right now absolutely